Salutations, Internet. I'm Scrollers, and welcome back to Call of Cthulhu, Dark Corners of the Earth. What? The game froze! Are you kidding me? Okay, so I think that it's gonna work now. I hope it's gonna work now. I hate everything. Okay, so I'll, I'll be completely honest. Part of the reason I want to be done with this is just because I'm getting so tired of all these crashes. But, yeah, here we go. Where was I going? I don't remember where I was going. I got chased by the Shogoth. And then where did I go? I don't remember. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Don't stop. Don't stop. Don't stop. Don't stop. Don't stop. Can't stop. Won't stop. Ah. Run, Jack. Where am I? Uh, better. Oh shoot, what is this? Well, okay. Um, can I step on this? Okay. Ah! No, I can't. Why would it let me step on that for a second? Oh, right here. Um, so it seems we found where the Shogoth went. Okay, that's good. Question mark? Probably not good. Oh, yeah, don't, don't turn around, don't turn around. I have a feeling that I don't want to turn around. As long as I don't turn around, I should be fine. I think. I hope, I pray. Ah! Get out, get out, get out, get out, get out! I gotta get out of here now. Okay, we're fine. I can't move. No can move. Okay, as long as nothing comes up from down there, help. Uh, okay, we're fine. See? Everything. Nothing's gonna take me down. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Are we stuck? I can't, I can't do anything. I can't do anything. Jack's just freaking out. Stop freaking out, Jack. Uh, what's happening? Get up there, get up there, get up there. Oh, what happened? Did I die? I can't see. Everything is so black. Oh, what? Ah, Mr. Walters. I see you made it at last. What? Seems Marsh managed to give you the slip. Okay. Fortunately, we had him picked up as he tried to flee. Okay. Me order of Dagon will make you pay for this over. I am Cthulhu. I am Dagon. Yeah, I, I got this ugly bastard out of my. I was thinking about that SpongeBob meme. <laughs> yes, sir. Come on, Marsh. Move it. Hoover, you got to evacuate the building. There's something yes, down there. Yes, there's something down there. All in good time. We found a key in Marsh's possession. A key he was most reluctant to give up. It okay. must have been for the elevator panel. Giving access to an additional floor oh. at the very foundation well, I want of that. this refinery. Well, we can't go down that All low. My agents are busy planting explosives to flatten this place to the ground. No, I no, want no, you to no, find no, 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 and check it out. Not a chance. I already told you. There's something down there. I barely got out yeah. alive. I made it clear back at the asylum, Mr. Walters. I don't make requests. Then okay. you go. But I'll be needing another oh, yeah. gun. Give me a gun. What kind of gun did you give me? What gun is this? Give me. I don't see a gun. And a pistol? Really? Okay, so I guess he's gonna send us to our death again. I thought we were cool, Hoover. Let, let me here? pass. Let me pass. I only take commands from Hoover, <laughs> and my orders are to not let you out till you've checked the base. I wonder if it would let you just shoot them and try to fight them. But I don't want to take that chance right now. I figure that since I saved him, he would be like, "Oh, hey, Jack, you're cool. You saved me. I almost died." But it's like, no, Jack, go to your death. Yeah. Where's the elevator? Oh, this was the elevator. Okay, for some reason I thought that was the elevator back there. Oh, where did they? Um, yeah, back here. Okay. So now, to the underground we go. All right. So, oh, wait, no, I need to press this, don't I? To my death. Oh, shoot. How am I gonna? Oh, okay. I kind of want to see what's up here. Hmm. Anything I can use? Let's go away from the heights. 
Doesn't look like there's anything. Oh, there's a slide down, I guess. I think that's just a cable. Yeah. At first I thought it was one of those, like, fireman's balls. Let's not look down. Ah! <laughs> I meant to do that. You can see the Shogoth. Calm down, Jeff. Calm down, Jeff. Calm down, Jeff. What are those? I see something swimming. Look up, look up, look up, look up. It's fine. It's not fine, but it's... Okay. There's something swimming. Ah! Ah! <laughs> I didn't mean to do that, obviously. Okay, so how am I supposed to get down there then? Yep. Oh. Okay, I see, I see, I see. So the ladder isn't fully there, that's why I fell. Okay, that makes a little bit more sense. So then how do I get down there? Okay, so is this it? Oh, careful. The fuses are primed. You've got 20 minutes before this place blows. Move! 20 minutes? Dude, what the... Okay, okay. So you have 20 minutes before we die. That's always good. Okay. Okay, so I thought I thought that these th Okay, I see now. I thought these whistle smokes were things swimming down there. That's why I was so afraid to go down. Ouch. Did I break something? Oh. Well, it looks like I got Oh, I need sutures. Well, too bad, Jack. Should have thought of that before you broke it. There's money. Strange. The gold is an odd hmm. whitish color. Yeah. Ah! Why does he want me to go down here? God dang it. What am I broke? I broke my leg. Don't worry, I can fix it. I am out of sutures, though. Ah! I was beginning to think Hoover's actually a cool guy, you know? But now he just sent me to his death. Oh! Sanity loss can be controlled by avoiding traumatic situations and minimizing your exposure to horrific or disturbing imagery. Okay. That's good to know. Why can't I move? All they're giving me is a... Can't believe I spent so much time practicing with the hatch release. ay yeah, yeah. Okay, what is this? What is this? It's a secret gold vault. This must be where the marshes hoard their wealth. Okay, now if only I could climb back up. Oh, wait. Somebody closed the hatch. And by somebody, I mean Hoover. Gold Vault A? Why not? Yeah. So where are we going? Up here, I guess. My death. Victory or Sovereign Guard, but death. Yeah, death. Because that's gonna. That's what we're gonna find here. It reeks of death, Milady. We cannot find anything else. But death. The stench of death. It permeates. Yuck. It permeates. Highly flammable gas. It won't open. This pressure valve controls the flow of gas. Uh. That's not what I thought I did. Okay, so I assume that I have to somehow start a fire. And kill the Shogoth. Ah, that was a bad idea. Okay, so he doesn't seem too happy about that. Whoa, it's all woozy now. Okay, we're fine. The door is bolted, bolted shut. Bolted shut? I was just in Gold Vault A. Can I open that from you? Is that just a shortcut back? Okay, so I have no idea what I'm doing. Go on out there. 
So I think we want. Oh, I almost fell. So I would think we want Gold Vault C. But I assume it's not going to open because of that. I won't be able to get through this way. That does cause sparks, though. That could start a fire. Can I make it to this door without getting burned? Guess not. How badly did that mess me up? Not too bad. I just need a bandage. And now I'm out of bandages. Okay, so I am on the verge of death. That is fine. Okay, so I'm kind of stuck here. I don't know where I'm supposed to go. I guess I can try to cross here. Okay, I think I get it. I think I get it. So I open this. Wow. Okay, so now I have to run through this. Okay, okay, I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it. Oh, but I need... I need a gas mask, though, probably. Maybe I start the gas, then turn it off, and then run. That could work. Is every, it's just weird, does everything seem washed out? Oh, it's because I need two bandages, huh? But I only have one bandage. Shoot! This pressure valve controls the flow of gas. Okay, so... Close it! Go! 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 Go, go, go. Go, go, Power Rangers. All right, so you got through it. It's good. So there's another thing without a valve. It's a valve for controlling. It won't open. Okay. Hmm. Sorry about how everything kind of washed out. I don't have any more bandages, so we have to deal with it. I wonder if I could have shot it. I should have tried that, maybe. Although, I don't really imagine it doing anything to it. Doesn't sound like a Lovecraft monster. Lovecraft monsters are monsters indeed. Alright, alright, alright. Okay, alright. Okay. Going left and turning around. Going around the corner. Jumping up here. Yeah. Okay, 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 okay. So here's the gold. The gold is so yeah, the gold has an oddish color. white color to it, so I don't know what that means. Is that Maybe that has something to do with the ocean? I don't know. What's this? Urgh. Can't open this? No, I can't. Okay. Hopefully I'm not slowly dying of blood loss here. But I have a feeling that's what's going on. Huh. I remember this. This? Okay, yeah, I think I'm definitely dying of blood loss. I really hope I come across a medkit soon. Ah! Okay, he doesn't care. That's good. I suppose. What is that? Can I jump over him? Good to know. Whoa. That was close. You don't have to try to jump this. Okay, I'll run into. Wait for him. Classic platforming challenge. Yep. Yep. Oh, what? I landed on it, right? Okay, so well, the bright side is we get to start a little earlier now. Before I started bleeding. Can I move? So am I bleeding now? Okay, so I might as well take care of that and then just pray that it doesn't happen again later. Ah, there it is. Hey, buddy, what's up? Go one of those days, eh? Yep. Yep, go. Yep. Yep. Yep, make the jump. Make the jump. Okay, whew. Hopefully I'm not too... Oh, come on! That bad? Really? I can take a splint at least. That's about as best I can What's do right now. Happening to me? Oh, hope is dry. Not even gonna give me a. Oh. Death, death is my only escape. Okay, so they're not gonna give me a med kit for this encounter. This to the end. That kind of sucks. Okay, keep going through. I can't handle this anymore. Open in the door. Oh, there's a dead guy. Yeah, okay, med kit always has that. Okay, how many sutures that can be? One suture. Oh, but there's just the bandages, though. Okay, so I can use two bandages. Woo! Okay. So we are on the verge of death. 
seems to be the theme of this episode. What are you? The body's cold. Ugh. He must have been dead for some time. The body's cold. Can I take the wrench? He, he won't need this anymore. Yes, but you will, Jack. Can I not? Oh, I would assume I could use that as a weapon, like <laughs> Bioshock style. Okay, 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 okay. So we're gonna go and uh. The door's bolted shut. I know it's bolted shut. Unbolted. What was here? This was. What about? Hey, I've been here. Oh, but now I have a wrench. So can I use a wrench on something then? What needs to be wrenched? There's got to be something out there that needs a wrench. And oh, the valves. Yeah, that makes sense. I could turn this one. Do I need to interact with it, or can I? Do I can I just interact it's with a it? Valve for controlling the floor. Okay, so I think I need to actually use the wrench on it. Yes. No. Okay. Yeah. All right, Jack. Yeah. Wrench it up. You got it, bro. Am I just gonna turn on all the gas flow? It won't open. Finding my way back to civilization. Okay, so there's those two all. I don't know, Jack, what are you doing here? Okay, so we got number four. And then we have one more. And if what I think is gonna happen is gonna happen, then I think that we're probably gonna go and open that door over there, which is gonna cause sparks, which is gonna cause this gas to ignite. So that would be interesting. And oh, well, I can't get back to the guy shoot him. Yeah, I thought not. Through here, I don't need to go through here again. Well, I'm just gonna leave me to that. So where was the door that I opened? This one? The door is bolted shut. Oh, this is for B. If I pass this, then I just go through here and not be able to make it. Hang on, hang on, I'm lost. So I guess I have to go through that again because I don't see a way back. Because the only way back was through A, which would be through this door again. But he just seems to be thrashing about. So does he have a pattern then? He seems to be freaking out right there. And then he comes out this way and lashes out. Okay, so that's my that's my chance. Yep. Yep. Go for it. Got it. Whoa, ba -ba 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 -ba. Okay, okay. We're fine. We're fine. Close this just in case. Oh, well. Somebody's having a bad air day. Oh, this took longer than it needed to. Okay, so. Hopefully. Hopefully I'm actually doing something and I'm not just uh, uselessly flailing about, flailing about, trumpeting, not trumpeting, but that's not a word. What word am I thinking of? Trumpeting, trumpeting, tromping, trundling? I don't know. So I'm gonna do this, hopefully this works out. Oh, it did do, oh yes it did, it did! Oh, come on, I should've been further away. Oh, that's, that's pretty bad, is that any sutures? All right, so it's dead now, right? Hope so. Seems dead. So where do I go? This way? Seems like it. Hmm. Open the door, going through, taking the left, taking the right, I mean. Now we're taking the left. Another left. Down the stairs. Taking the left. Oh, what is this? What? Ah, I can't pick it up. The gem is firmly locked. Oh, what happened? I was about to scratch my nose. Buddy, what's up? You having troubles? I mean, I'm willing to help you, I guess. What's wrong? A 
what? Oh, it's water. It's a reflection. Oh my god, it's Cthulhu! Staring at the statue is making my head pound. Okay, on well, the stone, I guess. Whoa! Huh. Interesting. The claw can't be pried open with my bare hands. Oh, what? I can move it. Where do I move it, though? Okay. Okay, it's a puzzle then. If it's a puzzle you want, it's a puzzle you get. What is happening? Calm down, Jack. Calm down, Jack. Oh, I took it. Okay. Oh, shoot, what's that? Mackie? No. At last, we found you. What do you mean you found it's me? It's nice of you fellas to show up. What the hell is this place? Who knows? It's some sort of shrine. Probably used by the marshes for private worship. And the oversized gargoyle? That's no gargoyle, Agent. That's Cthulhu. Mm. Fellas, this chamber's about to be buried under four floors of brick and metal. Okay, Walters, let's get out of here before this place blows. Okay, what if the statue just chases us? Okay, I guess not. Oh, God, it's glitching. This, this, is, this game has been like... This game is so glitchy. But I still think it's really good in spite of all this. Yay! Blew up the marsh refinery. We're done with it. Okay. That was one big explosion in the refinery. One moment I was running for my life, the next I was face down with a mouthful of dirt. I just hope everything inside was destroyed. What the hell was that thing in there? Some kind of monster jellyfish? How could it move out of the water? How could it even exist? My ears are still ringing with the screams of Hoover's men as the acidic slime engulfed them. Despite the casualties, though, the raid hit... No. The raid hit Pater. The feds recovered a briefcase with some very incriminating papers. It seems that, among other things, the Marsh family, Sebastian in particular, has been trafficking with enemies of the state. He's been offering a contagion, some sort of gem, some, some kind of gem weapon, to the highest bidder. This is in violation of all kinds of international treaties, but that didn't surprise me. Even if the Marshes care about such things, which I doubt, I could well believe the news of the treaties had wait i could well believe that news of the treaties hadn't ever reached ends with okay that sentence makes more sense but i know there's more to the story like that shrine on the lower floor of the refinery the carvings of those hideous gods are more are one more thing that will probably haunt my dreams for some time to come why did they seem no why did they seem familiar in any case the evidence of arms dealing gave Hoover what he needed to bring the, the big guns. Literally, Innsmouth is now under martial law. A coast guard, cu a coast guard cutter, is stationed in the harbor with a company of marines on shore, led by Robert Marsh. The surviving members of the or esoteric order of Dagon are holed up in the old Masonic Hall. I suggested pounding the place to dust with the uh, marines' artillery and then, and the cutter's guns. But, oh, Hoover wants Marsh alive. Okay, I was reading that weird. Sorry. That's not going to be easy. The marines who attacked the main entrance of the building went into some kind of psychotic seizure before they could reach it. The brass, th the brass thought Marsh had laid down some kind of gas in the area, but gas masks didn't help the second storming party. That was when Hoover remembered a report of an old smuggler's tunnel close by the banks of the Manuxit River that was said to lead into the building from below. It seems my good luck just never ends. With so many agents killed and wounded in the refinery, Hoover has decided that I'll have the dubious honor of representing the FBI in an attack through the secret entrance in company with a squad of Marines. I have to meet with a Sergeant Carter and his men by the refinery gates. Then we'll set out along the frozen river looking for the tunnel. I may never sleep again. Not that it would make much difference. The waking sounds and visions are getting worse, well, are getting worse all the time. Though if they are linked with the events here in Innsmouth, maybe getting to the bottom of this horror will help me recover my lost memories. Not sure you want those back, Jack. So now we're in the second to last chapter. That's good, I think. I think this is the second to last chapter. How long have I been recording? Uh, I'll record a little bit longer. Make up for last episode. The last episode was supposed to be... Have your men last been episode was supposed to be longer, but... Oh. Sold smuggling route? Not yet. Our intelligence estimates the most likely site would be further downstream. Okay. The Minuxit is frozen over, so we should be just fine on foot. Let's get moving. Okay. Move out, Marie! And I still don't have just a pistol. Where are we going? Where are we going? Let's go. Oh. Move out. I can't hear anything. Cover our flank. Are we going this way? Oh, yeah, okay. Go, run! Keep your eyes peeled and your weapons ready. Alright, we're gonna shoot some guys. 
I mean, I would prefer to have more than just a pistol, but okay. You ready to shoot him? Yeah, whoa. What is this? Where are we? What? Oh, they're coming from behind, too. They're moving where? Where do I drop? Do I drop down here? Oh, down here, okay. I guess? No? Okay, so where were they going from? Right there. What's right there? So down here, right? I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. I'm going. Ah! Okay, so I guess the ice is thin. Okay, so I just broke something. Well, that sucks. Well, I'm stuck moving slow now, because I just broke a leg. This is as fast as I can go. Or are they just beating them up? Oh, there's fish people. There's something kind of humorous about them just kicking at them. To me, at least. I'm not sure what that says about my sense of humor. Oop. Okay, so the second we get a chance, I need to repair my leg. My leg. Okay. Oh, I see a save point. Oh, what's this? What is this? That seems like something wrong with Okay, I'm gonna. Okay, I have a split. Good. So there's a thing in some kind of tunnel, also. I have a feeling we should be concerned about that. Hey guys, what's up? What's going on? There's only one of you. They're all dead, aren't they? Oh. They were trapped. There was nothing anyone could have done. Damn it! I tried to tell them, but the corporal wouldn't listen. They just wanted to slaughter those things. Those fishmen. What's your name, soldier? Private Parker. Parker. Private Joe Parker. Joe. Well, Parker, it looks like you found the old smuggling entrance. Good job. The door's frozen over. I already tried to open it, but it's stuck fast. Uh. We'll have to melt the ice. You operate the flamethrower. I'll call the door. Oh yeah. So up, 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 up. Oh, I thought I was gonna actually be able to like carry around the flamethrower. Wishful thinking, I suppose. Whoa. Parker, hold it. Got a bad feeling about this. Uh, he's fine. He's fine. Oh. Well, um, uh, well, he's he can he still lives. Oh, uh, well, never mind. Uh, she's dead. I don't care. Okay, so into the tunnels we go. Oh, I see that. Oh, what is that? Meh. It's... It's coming right towards me. Can't close this. Well, shoot, it's coming right towards me. Oh, wait, I still have the flamethrower. No, I don't. Can I activate this? That works. Probably still waiting for him to get in front of me. Okay. I'm a, oh god. Come and get me. Uh, you coward. Is this AI glitched or something? Okay. This is very slow. Uh, but, but he looks like he's about to run. Come for me. Come for me. Oh, we're about to have calamari. Come on. Come on. You're not that scary. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. Okay. <laughs> that took longer than it needed to. We got it done. Okay, is he dead? He doesn't seem to be dead. He's just kind of playing around. He's still playing around. This is going unnecessarily long. Is this stuck in a loop or something? Okay, no, he's, he's, he's dying. Okay, can I look? Can I examine his body? Yes, I can. What the hell could have spawned such an abomination? Cthulhu, man. Who wears... Oh, poor Parker. Looks like I'm on my own again. <laughs> no words for the recently deceased, I see. A hefty Ooh. chunk of dynamite. Well, see, here's the problem. Now I'm out of bullets. Okay, 
is asleep. There's a safe point here. Holy more bullets, thank god. What? Oh, it's rifle bullets. I don't have a rifle. Well, shoot. Hopefully I find a rifle soon. Jack? Is that you? Mackie? Mackie, where do they keep the keys to the cells? I don't know for sure. Probably somewhere up in the main hall. What the blazes is going on? A few hours ago, the government sanctioned a full-scale operation into Innsmouth. Hmm. It seems you were right about the contagion. Yep. I knew it. Why the delayed assault on the order? We have to arrest Robert Marsh now. Well... They can't breach the doors. Yeah. Anyone who gets close is driven mad. The guards were discussing some mural that Robert Marsh had etched onto the main doors. Okay. They said it was powered by a sacred ceremony to the old ones. Whatever the hell that means. We have to okay. stop that ceremony. Sit tight, Mackie. I'll be right back. Yeah, sit tight, Mackie. I got this. I'm gonna grab the rifle first. It's a large bronze key. We have to stop that ceremony. It's locked. Find the keys and get. I am getting it. Okay. Get me the key out of doesn't here. fit. The key doesn't fit. Okay. So I'm gonna save again. Now that I have my gun. Hopefully this isn't this doesn't feel too long. I'm trying to keep the flow good. So hopefully that's fine. What was that? Yeah. Some kind of demented starfishes. Ah! How do I get that off? That actually scared me. <laughs> Did I have to shoot them? Oh no, that one's more prominent than the others. Okay, I see, I see. The door is covered in a hostile strain of starfish. Ah, come on, stop. Can I like use dynamite on it? I should find some place more volatile to put the charge. These barrels are filled with bootleg rum. Highly flammable stuff. Okay, inventory. This fuse will only last a couple of seconds. I better find cover. Well, I need and to quickly. move that. Okay, okay. Oh, are we fine? I need another bandage. My bandage as this explodes. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa, we killed them all. Yuck. Okay, I don't like those. Oh, the esoteric order of Dagon. Okay, so. Oh, the game is loading. Okay, there you go. It's always awkward when the game first loads and it's like, did it's this crash or what? How many? I have only have 22 bullets left. Do I have any? I do have stuff for my revolver, so if I can find a revolver, that'd be great. Sneaking up this. Yeah. Bricks. I knew it. Open in the door. Oh, it's a lovely house. Hey. What is this? I better watch my step. This place could be crawling with guards. Well, that's just lovely, because I'm so great at stealth. It's locked. It's locked. What about the key? Oh, where'd the key go? Did I use the key on something? I don't remember. Okay, so something's going down. I'll need the combination, combination. before I can... What's going on? Don't turn this way, please. Whatever you do. He's just standing there. Menacingly. Okay, so I guess it's safe to run. This guy doesn't look like he's gonna turn around. If he does, and that's a pretty cheap move. Sneaking around just to get through the house and I Oh my god. Yeah. Get through the town. 
finding my way back to Sibylla. Don't let me to do that. Open this, open this, open this. It's an old rusty key. Old rusty key. Good. Go. Go down. Is it this way? Okay, I think we escaped them. It's locked. But there's not. Okay, there's the key on it. The key doesn't. What? Okay, so now I have an old rusty key. Not sure what that's for, but I'm glad we have it. Oh, a knife. I can feel a draft of air from behind this bookcase. Okay, we'll go in there in a minute. Can I? Oh, yeah, I was pushing it. Okay. It's a hidden passage. All right, so going through. Oh, medkit. Do so I need anything healed? I don't think so. Hang on. Yeah, I don't need. I don't need anything. I haven't had to use antidotes yet. So it makes me wonder, like, what are those useful for? It won't open. It won't, won't open. Okay, so I just went through here. Just sneaking around just to get through the town. I don't like this one bit. Me either, Jack. Well, that didn't do as much damage as I would. There we go, there we go, okay. Well, I can't go back to right here. Faster, Jack! Okay, we're fine. This room has some kind of blue light to it. The doorway is sealed, but it's a small stone plaque engraved with text from some ancient language. Okay. I assume that the ritual's going on in there then. Can we use the Book of Dagon? Probably. Hang on, hang on. According to the text, yeah. only a prayer to Dagon can break the seal. A seat. prayer to Dagon. So how do I pray to Dagon? It's a small oh, here we go. It's unlocked. Okay, there's the door I needed. Oh, goody goody gumdrops. They're just old storage shelves. Um, I can't use any of those. Another save point? Good. Uh, what's over here? A ladder? Okay. So I'm gonna save, and then we are gonna continue on, and, uh... Yeah. Okay. So climbing up here, going up the ladder. Look at me. Perfect stealth. Nobody knows who I am or where I came from. I am the embodiment of stealth. Budge. Budge. I am the embodiment of stealth. No door can block me out. Yes. Well, they saw me. Are they running now? Shoot, 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 shoot. Okay, these guys are really dumb. They seem to have forgotten I existed. Seems to be a problem with Innsmouth. Must come with the curse. I mean, maybe the room where your other friend just walked in and disappeared? Where is it? Where are they? They just straight up disappeared. Oh, oh, reload. The trap door has no handle on this side. Oh, there's a trap door. So there's only one more of them, so I'm not too worried. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, look at this. It's a small stone. So does that say the same thing? According to the text, only a prayer to Dagon. Prayer to Dagon, okay. Seal. Okay, so going through here. I don't see any guards. Thankfully. The door's bolted, bolted shut. shut. 
I hear something. Did they just shoot at me? Where's the gunshot coming from? Hmm. Okay, so I hear a sound. It sounds like Ramona. It looks like the diary of oh my Robert God. Marsh. I almost shot Ramona. I would have felt so bad. Ramona? Ramona? Okay. There's more Cthulhu's. An ugly stone statue. <laughs> it suits the place. <laughs> it suits the place. Okay, so um, I got something, so I need to read it real fast. I'm assuming that's gonna be under evidence. The Diary of Robert Marsh. This is gonna be fun. The translation of the tablet is progressing well. Soon the word of Father Dagon shall be known to us in its entirety, as it is to those below in Jan Flay. How do you pronounce that? Then, armed with knowledge of the divine purpose, we shall be able to take our place beneath the waves on equal terms, and the grand design set in motion more than 80 years past shall draw towards completion. Ya Dagon, ya Hydra, ya ya. Poor Darwin, to be so completely wrong. For the higher forms of life are those who return to the sea, not those who forsook it for the land. And in generations to come, as the last remaining taint of human blood leaves our strain, we shall ascend to the true knowledge and true power in the love and service of Father Dagon and Mother Hydra. But there is much needed still to no, but there is much still wait, but there is much still need but there is much still to be done before that glorious future is assured. The outsider could still ruin everything. The one will be sacrificed, but the other who has come looking for him must be dealt with. Innsmouth must remain undisturbed until everything is complete. That which eluded my ancestor Obed on his death in 1878 shall not escape me. If only Sebastian could understand that, understand things as I do. His, uh, his science, his meddling in the surface world, how meaningless they all are. Once we take our place amongst the elder ones, how small his endeavors will seem. But he has been deaf to the word of Dagon, no matter how I have tried. Perhaps upon his return, with the translation so much further advanced, I can make him see the truth. That doesn't seem good. Can we break through this glass? No, but it doesn't seem like it. Oh, we can break through this glass, probably. Oh, this is, Hy this is Hydra. Screw you, Hydra. Okay. Some smokes and a desk lamp. Not much of any interest. Oh, what's this? Oh, why can't I move? Oh, there's a chair there. A large mural is engraved with text. For okay, somebody get my The Book of Dagon is missing a few of the symbols. It's this a prayer of some sort. Prayer of some I can't sort. complete the translation. So I need to find the remaining pages then. Okay, so I'm gonna go see if there's I'm gonna go see if there's anything else downstairs, I guess. Uh, can I uh I was hoping I could yeah. Oh, but there's a guy there. There's a car alarm going outside also, but I don't know if you hear that. You guys just there we go oh uh what hang on hang on yeah let me the last thing i picked up was the director robert marsh maybe it's in this 1878 8 1878 oh yes that's it all right. The safe holds a Ooh. pistol, a crumpled scroll of paper, and a heavily bound manuscript embossed with the word Ponape. What's Ponape? Uh. Oh. Okay, so the list missing from the Book of Dagon. What about the. What's Ponape? I'm curious now about that. Let's read that real fast. Can you read that? Uh, I don't want to read all this. Ah! The scroll of the paper reads, To hold a prayer to Dagon. Translated into English, it reads, in thy, in thy name let us behold the Father. From the depths of the waters I come. And from the depths the deep ones also have come. Hail to the ancient dreams. Hail to Dagon. 
Okay, Pompeii scripture. Okay, this heavy bound manuscript. Oh God. Ah, we don't have time. Okay, I'm gonna read it real fast. You can skip it if you want. Just skip ahead a bit. The heavy bound manuscript is embossed with the word Pompeii. It claims to be a re reprinting of an original manuscript written by Captain Ebner Ezekiel Hwag in 1734, describing his encounters with a strange cult in the islands of the Pacific. Hwag claims that the islands worship and even interbreed with strange beings from the sea and reproduces much of the lore from this unspeakable religion. There are harrowing passages that tell unspeakable sacrifices by which these deep ones are appeased and have objects cast into the sea to summon them. By means of the correct rituals and offerings, they can be induced to bring fantastically worked jewelry of gold for the islanders, although his, con his conforms to their own strange anomaly rather than that of any human being. Huang recounts the islanders' tales of fantastical underwater cities constructed according to some obscure and inhumane laws of geometry and architecture. Some legends tell of islanders transforming into sea creatures as they grow old. And going to live forever beneath the sea. Well, that's kind of, that's kind of sweet, I guess. The greatest of the deep ones, Father Dagon and Mother Hydra, are said to be fantastically old, hailing from a time before the first human walked upright. Strangely, he stresses that these stories are not primitive metaphors for an afterlife, like similar tales from an island cultures, but recounts them as actual fact. He claims to have seen and conversed with these creatures himself, and witnessed several of the island ceremonies and offers, offerings to them. Okay, interesting. Alright, so the scriptures were here. Can I... Oh! I'll need more information to... Can I use this? The prayer to Dagon reads, Bahuin and Kugnath, Fanu Nayemna, Vunag Lazai, Vunag Lazana, I uh Raikazengaro. I uh Dagon. Okay. Alright, so we're gonna do that in the next episode. How do you like that for an ending? So anyway, have a lovely day and I'll hopefully see you next time. Bye!